but during that time I had my own babies. So I had three daughters, 10, seven, and five now. And wow. uh, I would be going That's to the lot. health food stores, <laughs> going to the health food stores, looking for products for them. Mm-hmm. And knowing how to make good quality adult products, I was always kind of annoyed by the label ingredients for kids products, thinking, you know, we can do better. We should be doing better. And uh, I was always putting products back on the shelf. So in the end, after Jameson purchased the company and um, our office was closed in Vancouver, I knew that I wasn't really done. And at the same time, one of my daughters was diagnosed with iron deficiency. Mm. So we Mm. were searching high and low for Mm -hmm. great quality products. And we actually did come up empty handed. She hated the taste of all of them. Even the ones that were full of sugar, she couldn't handle them. And I just was really frustrated that everything either had an alcohol base or a sugar base, Mm -hmm. or it told you how to clean their black teeth after taking the product. It, It was just, it became, you know, a horrible experience. Yeah, and of course she still horrible. had a problem. She yeah, still had yeah, a problem yeah. we couldn't fix. Yeah. So I am um, I went to the raw material suppliers that I knew from from my experience and I was like, what can we do? How can we make a clean product? And you know, she needs this now. And so I made a product for her. She loved the taste and I was really happy with the ingredients. So and I thought at that point I can't be the only parent who's in this scenario trying to find great quality products for their kids to solve a problem. And so I, you know, Kid Star was born. 